Hello, I am Yed4455, and welcome back to another game of Banished in the town of the Forest of Oak. Uh, right, we had a little starvation event last episode, but I think we got that pretty well in hand now. So now it's just trying to grow the population and, you know, resources and tools and all that fun stuff. So yeah, we do have a lot of work to do in this town. Um, let's see. Yeah, food is fine. Really fine. Um, resources are doing all right. I do have a woodcutter in the town. And I just got a first blacksmith. So they're going to be working re really nicely. So yeah, I just need a lot of workers now. So hopefully that will get that going soon. So yeah, it's going to be really hard. To get the rest of them, you know, the rest of these resources going without people. So yeah, we just gotta sit tight and wait for that. Do 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 do. Let's see how my house is doing. Got a lot of kids coming up. Still think that's weird. Eleven-year-olds living in their own house. But you know, what are you gonna do? It happens. Right. Should probably get a hunter's lodge with it. But I am going to eventually build more farms here. This is like a per perfect farming site. So yeah, that's going to be for that. What am I low on? Firewood. Yeah, I figured. I mean, he's trying to keep up with it. And unfortunately, I'm losing out on a lot of wood. I just don't have the people right now to really do anything with it. So, I mean, the next thing is definitely going to have to be a forester. I have no idea where I'm going to put that. Because um, there's a lot of rivers. And I do want to keep this cleared. I could build it somewhere over here. Here might be a, actually a really good spot. Then I could clear this stone. Yeah. I think that's what we're gonna do. We're at least gonna get it built. Yeah. So, like right around here. So, I'll put it right at the edge of where I'd want those farms. Yeah, right there. I know it's gonna be a little bit far away, but it'll be fine. And I just gotta make sure there's a road to it. There we are. Yeah, it'll be a little bit far away, but I think it'll be fine. See, I do want it far away enough from the camp that I could have this area for farming and still have that wood option. Say, so I'm gonna go ahead and drop another farmer. You actually reach your tool limit. Go ahead and bump that up. Uh, just to a hundred. There we are. Because <clears throat> yeah, if I could at least get that going, and that's fine. Me being stuck on 200 firewood is actually perfect. Because yeah, then they'll get this going. Hopefully, I need 32 logs, which might be a little bit of a stretch. Actually, where's that? I think we all will just put this on... No. I think we will just put this on 50. Just so I can keep the... You know, try to keep up with wood. Yeah, that is one of our biggest problems right now, is wood. So I think, actually think I'm going to uh, just harvest this forest here. There we are. That should do it. Because that is the one thing I do have to keep up with the most. 
See a sad face. Oh, I see it. Yes. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, I never noticed that before. That does make a pretty cool sad face. Who would have thought? Alright, they're still making tools. Even though I told them not to. Right, that works. They're planting. It's almost halfway to being yield time there. Okay. I almost got enough logs for this. And you're building me my road to my forester. Excellent. Yeah, just having a wood, the wood issue again. <clears throat> so that's the one thing I need to get solved. And I still need a lot of wood here. All right, I just need two pieces left, so that should actually should be all right. Okay. Things looking good though. I at least got the food set up. So yeah, just waiting on that population to spike a little bit. So they had a child, child. One person by themselves, which is weird. Two people by themselves. Yeah, it's fine. <clears throat> All this looks good. All right, excellent. They are starting to build my forester. So then I could hopefully get back up there with this wood because it dropped quite a bit. All right. Up to four laborers. That's really good. Um, I don't think I'm going to put them in farming, though. I think I'm actually set in farming. I could probably drop a fisherman, too. So, yeah, I do have a lot of food now. So, yeah, that looks good. That's starting to be built, which is excellent. It's actually almost done, 96%. And I'm up to, uh, what is that, 30, 28 people? Excellent. And it's harvest time for at least the beans. The pot potatoes still have a little bit to go. But yeah, that's an early harvest. Late summer. I mean, I'll, I'm all for that. Alright, where's this builder at? You gotta finish building my Forester Lodge. I need more wood. And then I can start thinking about other things that I need to build. At the very least, I got the food situation handled. No more starvation events. See, I would think about maybe building a tailor, but I don't think I have the industry for that yet. Alright, that's built. Let's see, foresters. Let's get two foresters in there for now. I will have you plant and cut down trees. That should be alright. Alright. I am going to bump this up to 300. I think having a stockpile of 300 there would actually be really good. Alright. Then I think I think it might be time to build another line of houses. See, house there, house there. Perfect. And then, you know what? Let's actually do something like this. Yeah. I do want to stay on top of the housing right now. 
Get my little downtown part built. Alright, what am I low on? Logs, actually. Which is fine. I'm actually not that far in logs. Tools are fine. I'm up to 20 workers, though. So, yeah, my population is growing rather rapidly. Alright, let me add another forester. So, I do need more logs. And I think three laborers are fine. <clears throat> right, yeah, everything looks good here. And right away people moved into it, so okay. Yeah, all this is good. Good signs. Now, I am out of stone as well. However, I do have a large amount of stone here. So actually, what I am going to do, since it is winter, go ahead and collect all this stone. This will add more room for the trees to be planted. And I think I'm set on iron right now. So yeah, it's just getting me some more stone so I could have a nice little stockpile of it. Oop. Alright, what's going on here? Do do all right. You actually have an logs. Waiting on logs. Okay, you got your stone. You got your stone. Yeah, just waiting on that log. So yeah, we'll go ahead and chop down the rest of these trees here. There we are. That's fine for now. The four labors, excellent. Alright. And they are starting to chop down the stone. Which is good. Alright, that house is starting to be built, excellent. Alright, how about these other houses? They do have people in them as well. Alright, it's probably time to also build a herbalist. It's a gather. It's a crop field. Herbalist, there you are. Alright, the reason why we have to build a herbalist is I definitely need herbs. To help with the health of the town. And I think getting one of these up right away is actually going to be huge. So we'll build that right there, right next to the Forester's Hut. Yeah, and then this way we can collect herbs so I can start getting my health up because it is starting to drop a little bit. Happiness is fine. So yeah, unfortunately I do need a lot more logs for this. Of which I have none. So I'm probably going to have to chop down a forest again somewhere. Well, I don't know. Maybe they'll be able to keep up with it. I'm going to go ahead and add another forester. So they can keep up a little bit. Uh, did I lose my woodcutter or you just don't have enough logs? I'm going to go with uh, not enough logs. Right. You're probably telling me firewood. Okay. It is late winter, so I think... The firewood is going to become less of an issue here shortly. You guys are still trying to get that stone taken care of. I do hear these woods being chopped down a bit, so that's fine. Hopefully I can get enough wood for everything. Now what do you actually need to be? Alright, you got to remove some trees. You do need stone. Right, there, yeah, that's fine, because I'm going to get some more logs that way. Yeah, maybe I did try to expand the town a little bit too quickly. But I think we'll be fine here. Especially with everything growing here. Yep, just health. See, I definitely need that Forester's Lodge up. 
Or not the forest list, the herbalist. Alright, so in that case, we're gonna clear cut some trees. There we are. Go ahead and clear cut those trees. Because I am in desperate need of wood right now. Especially since I'm out of firewood. My tools are actually fine. So I'm not worried about that. Right, yeah, I just got... They're trying to do way too much right now, I think. That's right, they'll get caught up. Make sure it's on ten times, yep. My food is actually doing good. Since spring, I still have 3,000 food saved up. And they're planting, so yeah, food is fine. It's the one thing I was worried about to start. The blacksmith is still working, I think. And that just needs a few more logs. I think they're still trying to clear this area. They are. And I'm actually going to cut the farmers down. Just so I can get some more laborers to try to handle all this work. Because, I mean, I got so much food right now, I think I can afford it. There's just a lot of work to get done around this town. Especially trying to clear the stone, clear the wood. Get more wood. Alright, now it's starting to look better. Right, they are starting to plant some more trees. Which is good. I think they finally got that cleared. And it looks like they're starting to chop down this side, so that's just, all of that is good. Alright. I could consider starting to move out these farms. No, not yet. Don't think I quite need it. Alright, this one is finished. That's good. I will go ahead and put two builders just so I can always have two. It might be a little lean year for firewood, so there might be some freezing events, but I think we'll be alright. Yeah, the tools are fine. Just need these logs. And they should, should start moving some goods here. I hope. Alright, they are getting logs here. And the houses are all built. And they're starting to chop some firewood, which is good. Alright. Yeah, I'd, the population definitely exploded, though. And now I just gotta figure out where I, I could probably put the trader over here. Next to this fishing guy. Or I could put it on this, this river. Yeah, I could put it on this river. I think I got some space over here in which I could do that. Yeah, that should work. See, so yeah, eventually I will need a trader. So I can start trading goods and services with other people. Alright, why is this not... Why have they not started putting stone and stuff here? Alright, there they go. Starting to move some logs. Excellent. Alright, they are starting to harvest that. Let's go ahead and throw two more people in there. Just so I can make sure that this harvest is indeed done. That's fine. All of that is fine. Like, I am not happy in the position of that house, but whatever. Everything else looks good, though. 
What am I low on? Firewood, yeah. I assumed. Alright, about halfway there to building this herbalist stand. Just fine. I should probably consider building another barn as well. Eh, that being said, I think I'm pretty good here. Alright, they are starting to get everything harvested, which is good, so no worries there. And they're starting to get the potatoes done. Yep, everything's looking good. A lot of potatoes stocked up, a lot of beans stocked up. This town is looking good. Alright. Could also build... Ah, uh, excellent. Okay, I got everything stored up here. That's good. I could throw a couple of houses over here. But I think we'll hold off on that for now. Right. Okay, a trader. How much are you actually going to cost? Forester's Lodge, Herbalist, where are you? That's a tailor, that's a tavern. Is it over here? Nope. There we go. That's a market, that's a training post. Perfect. Wow, I need a lot. A lot of stone, which I have. Half of my iron. And a lot of wood reserves. Right. Well, we need this either way. So I need to just find where I can actually build it. Uh, looks like right here would be a good spot. Over here would be a good spot. See, I don't want it too far from my main town. Yeah, it looks like right here. Yeah, let's start that. And then in the meantime, I am going to need a bridge over this town. Okay, so let's go ahead and get a wooden bridge. Built over there. Wow, okay. I still need a lot of logs. The one thing I do not have in abundance. Okay, so, where is there a forest that I wouldn't mind cutting down? Over here is just south of my town. Yeah, let's go ahead and chop down the trees over here. Come on. There we are. Harvest all those trees. Yeah, I definitely need more trees to build all this stuff I'm trying to do. Yeah, and that's not good when we have people that are freezing. And I do have a lot of people here, though. You're still trying to get stuff from over here. Alright, I do have a herbalist now, so let me go ahead and throw one person as a herbalist. That's good. Alright. Thing is looking good. So yeah, I just need to get this built and the bridge built. They are starting to bring some trees over there. Almost got it. There we are. Now the builders can actually start building that. Then I can hook up this trading post with my bridge. Oh shoot. I think I actually built that in the wrong spot. Oh well. Can I... 
Can I just say, like, I don't want this? How do I cancel a building? Uh, there has to be a way to do that. No. There has to be something that I could select that just, like, cancel what you were trying to do. Because they are starting to bring stuff over. Like, I ultimately, I want this thing, but... But I don't want it there. I want to move it up, like, one spot. There we go. Or is that not it? Move road. Cancel removal. That do it. Yes, it did. All right. Well, guys, I think this is an excellent place to put in a pause. If you like what you watch, please consider subscribing to my channel. And also, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you haven't done so already, please like and follow me on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all the latest news. And also, check me out over at Patreon and support what I'm doing over there. I am yet 4455. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.